Uh, oh, B3. Good stuff. Good stuff. So, I'm now playing a London as black. Which which should be okay. I'll go with knight e4. Never allowing e4. He seems to be very sure of what he's doing. I'm not really sure why, because I think I have a good position. F6. Makes it, but I'm just better. Bishop C7, threatening queen D6. Probably gotta go F4 at some point. Or, or indeed Bishop A3. Three now. I'll take it. Queen F three. I don't like. Let me go Bishop C two. Maybe that's just being hyper accurate, but for no reason. But I feel like this. Bishop D three now and then E five. And I think his pieces are quite badly misplaced, actually. And besides, um, besides, I mean, I'm just, I have the two bishops, I have not a single weakness in my position. So there's every reason to be quite thrilled. Should be four, because why the hell not? Takes bishop h2. Just return the bishop. I'm hinting at queen c7. Always queen c7 now, I think. Rook f2. I think bishop d. No, that doesn't win. Oh, that would have been super ugly. Okay, I'm gonna just remove the bishop then. Threatening rook e3, winning a pawn. So queen of four wins a pretty fat pawn. Now we got rook coming to a1. Make it simple. That should be pretty much over. Rook e2, I got bishop d3. There's, there were even made threats on f1 there. Okay, he's fighting well. He is fighting well. 96 is the point. Or he's gonna go 96 now. But I got bishop f7. And then I got rook b2. Oh, he's got 98. That's a bit annoying. Let's play it safe then. Nothing is gonna stop me from gobbling up a couple of pawns here. Rook c3 now. Oh, I blundered. I blundered. You could have gone bishop c5. I had to take with the rock, but still it was lost. No.